Hey guys, what's up? It's your boy MV, and today I'm going to be showing you guys my setup first in line, baby. Always, and once again, I'm going to keep this very short. Right here, I'm going to start off right here. Actually, yeah, let's start off right here. We have my just case filled with all, just all of my boxes for my PC and my gear. I have two headphones. I have one from Ion and the new watch shoes. Um, I have this cool like wooden poster thing. I got it. I don't know. Like three months ago, I just finally put it up. I have my stabilizer. Um, no, no, crap. No, this is my slider, right? So, um, I really don't use this thing as much. It's really good, and I think I actually recently used it for like, a TikTok. So, for guitar stand, I usually host my guitar, except I don't have it under that right now. Now, let's get over to the actual setup. Right here, we have my old soundboard. It is amazing. I do recommend it. It has more control than that bad baby over there. Just that these kind of similar things that that saves way more room. You actually probably need to know more for this than for that. That kind of already has everything just simply right there ready for you. That you kind of have to go more in depth with the software and everything. Anyway, come on more over here. So this is called the GoXLR. I got it for my birthday around $250. Thank you so much, Grandma. Really wanted it. I'm very thankful that she got it. Right here we have a microphone. It's the Shure SM57. It's about $100 on average. Usually, you know, whenever you type in, it's like oh, 100 bucks. Down there, we have my mini fridge. Also got that for my birthday. We have my keyboard. It's Havoc 89 key. But, um, I changed the keycaps in black and white. Nice design, by the way. We, um, I got a Logitech G305 from when we were with, <laughs> when we were with Logitech. Um, highly recommend it. I'm getting a um, G502 very soon. We have my two ring lights. To control by remote that one's like 20 bucks that one's also 20 bucks not the same as my old ones by the way right here we have my chair it's a gtr racing i got the white fabric edition i think it's like 150 bucks right now i think it's kind of on sale if you do purchase it use code unseen thank you or well i think there's a link down below you'll see this um yeah use that <laughs> we have my amazon alexa we have my previous unseen mouse pad that I took the logo off of because I just got tired of the logo. I'm sorry, but it had to be that way. Right here we have my G Fuel shaker, which I don't use as much anymore because I don't really drink G Fuel like that. Also, right here we have my grand finale PC. Um, no graphics card, but that's okay. You don't need a graphics card when you own a team and edit their videos. I I switched to an i5. I think yeah, i5 unlocked. 9th gen, 9th gen, yes. Um, it's actually way better for um, Valorant. <laughs> I love that. And 64 gigabytes of RAM, which is very overkill. I did not even mean to do it. All that inside the NZXT H510 case. Highly recommend it. Very nice budget case. And lastly, right here, we have my two monitors. I switched them around. It used to be this is my main, this is my secondary. Then I realized, wait, this is the gaming monitor. This should be my main. It's the Asus, no model number on it. Um, it's an AC, it's an Asus monitor, 75 hertz, 24 inch. Same thing for this. It's a BenQ, 75 hertz, 24 inches. Yeah. Um, on to Jackie Evans. I can say that since I'm the editor. I already know who's next. Peace. It's unseen, Jackie. Yeah, this messed that up in the day. Uh. It looks a lot better at night, so I'm just gonna switch to night. This is probably as close to nighttime as it's gonna get. So first of all, let's do a quick little run through. So first of all, I think we'll start with the mouse pad because uh, most people don't like RGB mouse pads. I think it looks a little bit tacky and it's a bit hard on my wrist, but uh, it was like ten dollars. It was cheaper than a non-RGB mouse pad and felt really nice when I got it. So yeah, and for the mouse pad, I have the basic mouse for. Unseen, which is the Logitech G305 Wireless Edition. It's the mouse I use. Uh, it's actually so good. I have the adapter taped up here though, so that it doesn't lose signal because my PC is all the way down here. Um, yeah, the keyboard is the Gamma K K66. I don't like it as much, mostly because it's got blue switches and I'm a linear fan. But it's decent. It's decent. The monitor. BenQ XL 2411P. It's a 24 inch, 144 hertz monitor. It's all right, it's all right. I might be getting a different monitor, maybe 240 hertz or something, or just another 144 hertz. I'm not actually sure yet. The camera, this face cam, it's such an overkill face cam for someone with like 200 followers. People really out here streaming with a $700 camera. Canon 200D with the 18 to 55 millimeter lens. 
And accompanied with that, I use these like lights. You know, for my hand cam, I have a $20 random webcam. I have like a real plant as well, which is a really cool addition to the setup. I have a Stream Deck Mini because it was like 50 bucks uh, Australian, which is really cheap. Uh, and the wireless charger for my phone. So let's get on to the PC. So in here, we've got a Ryzen 5 2600 stock cooler because I haven't overclocked it because I don't need to. A 32 gigs of RAM, 3200 megahertz. Uh, some aero cool random ass fans that actually keep the CPU at like 30 degrees idle. Uh, this is going tomorrow. So right now it's a 1660, but I'm getting a 3060 tomorrow. This I'm actually going to be giving away once I hit a thousand YouTube subscribers. And power supply is a 450 watt power supply, but I'm getting a 750 watt power supply soon. Uh, so yeah, that's my setup tour. On to the next person. Yo, what's going on guys? It's Unseen Orca and today I'm going to be showing you my setup. Just to kick it off, on the right, you can see my PC, which has a RX 580, a Ryzen 5 3600, 32 gigs of RAM, and a mobile suit Gundam on the right for decorations. This is all housed inside of a Corsair 4000D case, which is really sturdy, and it holds up for a while. For audio, I use Razer Krakens. For output and for input, I use the Blue Snowball, which isn't the best, but you know, it gets the job done pretty well. For seeing, I mean, I don't know what you want to call it, but on my right, I have a 144 hertz monitor, which I usually have all my games on, obviously. And on my left is the same 144 hertz monitor, which I usually have Discord and Streamlabs on. My camera is a C920 from Logitech, which is a really nice camera and it held up for a while. For peripherals, I have the G Pro X Superlight, which I got a few days ago and it's starting to hold up nice. I like taking a liking to it as well as the Ant Pro, which is a keyboard I've had for over a year and has no problems with it. It's really sturdy. Some random mouse pad I got out of Amazon as well. And if I take a step back, as you can see, I have two lamps on either side of my desk for good lighting, as well as the plant for decoration. And the pride and joy of the main setup is the Sex is Temporary Gaming is Forever flag by 100 Thieves Frosty, which is the best purchase of this setup. Thank you for watching. What's up guys, it's Centrical, uh, and here's my setup tour. So, first off, we have the mouse. We got the Moto O Wireless. Uh, it's alright, I'm gonna upgrade soon in the future. But, and then the next thing is my uh, keyboard, the Apex Pro TKL. And then, um, I have my PC, which has uh, i5 and a 1060 I need to upgrade that uh, probably for Christmas I'm gonna like upgrade everything and then for my mic I have the AT2020 the Audio Technica and a I don't even know what the heck audio interface is but yeah and then so for my main monitor I have a 144 Hertz AOC curved and then for my second one I have a Dell just 60 Hertz monitor for chat and stream and then for my mouse pad, I have a Gutsy Aiden Island Collection one. And uh, for my chair, we have the GT Racing. I think it's called like A Series or something. But yeah. And then for my background, I kind of have like a Galaxy projector just shining on that wall. So that's basically it. Uh, make sure you guys go follow my Twitch. And yeah, peace. Alright, yo what up boys, uh, it's BLZ here. I'm going to be showing you guys my 2021 setup tour. Um, so to start it off, we got the desk. Uh, this is just like some random desk from Ikea. It's got like the two drawers or whatever. Um, and I bought LEDs, put LEDs all around that and like on my door and stuff. Um, we got like a monitor here. I got this for free actually. I don't even, at 60 hertz, it's nothing special. I got it for free. Um, this monitor is a 144 hertz Acer. It's a 24 inch. Um, I got that from like Best Buy on sale for like 200 bucks or something. Uh, again, nothing crazy. Um, this is my Ducky One Two Mini. All these keycaps like came in the box and stuff with it. Um, I'm thinking about getting like some new color keycaps though as well for it. Um, and this is my Logitech G Pro Wireless. It's just charging right now, but it is a wireless mouse. Um, it's like my favorite mouse I've had. It's definitely the best mouse out there. Um, and then this is just a Logitech mouse pad that like is like the extended one. And then on top of that, I have like my Steel Series like smaller one, just because it's just like more comfortable when playing. And like, I just personally like the feel of it. 
Um, and then over here, we got the blue snowball um, and the mic stand, like the arm stand. I got that on Amazon, the arm stand, and then the blue snowball I like Best Buy. Um, yeah, and then over here, we got the PC. This is a custom built computer. Um, I got a GeForce RTX 2070 Super in it, AMD Ryzen 3700X, um, 16 gigabytes of RAM, two um, eight gigabyte sticks. I don't know if you guys can like see that with the reflection. Um, yeah, nothing crazy, but that is pretty much my setup. I mean, this is just a, another Ikea chair, nothing crazy. Um, and then this headset is a T Titan, I think it's like a Titan Esports headset. Just for an FYI, we are, we have never beaten Titan Esports. We have lost to them every single tournament. And I mean, uh, not to mention their trial gold roster that we lost to. It was Diamonds and Immortals versus their gold roster. Bro, dude, that's a slap in the, like, like, what? I bought it off one of my friends. You can get them on Amazon as well. Uh, it's it's not that good. It's it's okay. I mean, it does the job. Um, yeah, but that's pretty much my setup. Nothing crazy. Got the Step Brothers poster. That's my favorite movie. The hockey picture. Favorite sport. But uh, yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Hey guys, this is Fresh, the new content creator for Unseen Esports, and today I'm going to be showing you my setup tool, but before we get into that, let's try and get up to 100 likes on this video, really appreciate it, and subscribe, really appreciate it if you can subscribe, smash that like button, and uh, let's get straight into the setup tool. So, the most important thing on my setup is my YouTube channel, so go and subscribe to my YouTube, let's try and get up to 2k subs, but uh, yeah, but the webcam I use is a 4k GoPro, so um, I I am going to be getting a Logitech 1080p webcam uh, soon, but I haven't thought of probably buying it yet because this uh, webcam does, um, the GoPro does, um, you know, good job for my streams. But the monitors I do use is a Samsung Curve monitors. They are 144Hz bang monitors. Recommend getting these if you like Curve monitors. So, yeah, the keyboard I use is a G513 uh, Carbon Logitech, uh, Logitech keyboard. It is mechanical keyboard, lovely keyboard. I've had so many keyboards in the past. I've had a Logitech, uh, Corsa K55, I've had a Razer Huntsman, and I've had a 1-2 Mini Ducky. They haven't done as best as the Logitech K um, J J513 Carbon. This is probably one of the best keyboards I've had uh, since, um, in a while. So, recommend getting that if you want to get a, a good mechanical keyboard. The mouse I use is a Turtle Beach um, Marina Mamba. A lot of people don't exactly know that Turtle Beach brought out a mouse. It was brought out a long, 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 long time ago. But it still does my, uh, the best job. And it is pretty cheap. So, if you want to get a brilliant uh, mouse and cheap, recommend getting that. Um... So yeah, the mic I use is a blue snowball matte black uh, mic. I am thinking of getting a HyperX or a Razer or a Hyper uh, or a Yeti mic. Not particularly uh, particularly uh, sure on uh, what mic I should get. So uh, can you put in the comment section down below what you suggest in on mics, and I'll probably buy one. I'm not sure on the best mic, so. It would, really, it would give uh, some help for me uh, to, you know, give some suggestions in the comment section down below. Uh, the headset I use is a uh, not a popular brand, but it is called Goodman's. Really good uh, headset. Um, recommend getting that if you want to get a good, uh, cheap, good and cheap uh, headset. Uh, brilliant headset, and um, I've it since I've had it, it's probably I've I've been in love with it so. Yeah, uh, the mouse mat I use is a Corsa MM350 extra large mouse mat. I'm I'm gonna be getting a new new mouse mat as it is kind of dirty and it is just I think it feels so small for me. So I am gonna be getting a way way bigger mouse mat. Uh, the speakers I use is two uh, two um, creative uh, speakers. The, the audio that comes from these speakers are absolutely phenomenal. So, 
recommend getting these if you want to get some good speakers and they are um i think they're cheap no actually no they're not cheap but um yeah these are uh a brilliant speakers the chair i use is absolutely basic and crap the it is kind of ripped and it's got cell tape and stuff like that but i will begin a gtx racer gaming chair but if Unseen does bring out a gaming chair, I'm 100% buying that. So, yeah. And you guys are probably wondering what specs I have from a PC. So, we're going to get straight into that. So, the spe specs I do have is a GTX 1650 graphics card. I will be getting a RTX 2060 Super soon. So, don't even worry about that. The CPU is a uh, i7 um, top gen. I'm not sure on the numbers, but I will be getting a i9 900K soon, so don't worry about that. That is actually being ordered, so yeah. Uh, the uh, RAM I do have is a 16 gig. I will be upgrading that very, very soon. Uh, I'll be upgrading that to a 13 gig RAM. So guys, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Uh, enjoyed the setup tour, and um, this is fresh from Unseen, and I'll see you guys uh, later. Peace.